Thank you for having me. All right, let's talk about rap music. Why the decision to go that route? Um, I've realized that a lot of female artists don't really take the rap thing seriously, you know, because of obviously the challenges that we go through when we rap. Mm -hmm. So I decided to rap because I don't just take myself as a rapper. Yeah. I take myself as an artist. So an artist can do anything that she wants. I can wake up tomorrow and decide to do jazz because I sing and rap. So for now, um, the love that I get when I rap is overwhelming. So that's why I decided, okay, let me just rap because yeah. I think that's what people want now because we don't have like a real good female rapper in the industry. How did Chachila Mrao do? Uh, Chachila Mrao did very well, but I was still back at home. I was still in Mafi Gang. You know, so I didn't have all the connections and I didn't know all the right people. So it just stayed in the Northwest, you know. So, but I think it did very well so far. All right. Talk to us about Kisses. What inspired that song? Um, Kisses, I wanted to introduce Fifi Cooper to South Africa, mm. not like a rapper, yeah, Mafi Gang Fela. So Kisses, if you can listen to Shashalam Racha and Kisses, you'll see the difference. Kisses is more like a song for everyone right. you know that's why we made we made sure that the hook is very simple for people to you know really sing along to it and the raps also i'm rapping more in english you know and just trying to accommodate people so it was i just wanted to challenge myself and you know do something different to add on on my music and what 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 space do you think you occupy in this institution that is Motoako? I mean, you can't speak about Northwest and not talk about Motoako. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Um, in the Motoako circle, we don't have a female rapper. Yeah. You know, we have female rappers in South Africa like Nadia and Bojiji, but I don't think they're doing Motoako. So I felt like you know what, uh, I'm from Mouth Town, so I have to represent where I come from. You know, uh, so that's, that's why I decided to do Motoako. All the Motoko guys, I take them as my brothers and I think they take me as their little sister because I've been rapping and I've been sharing stages with them so many times. Like uh, we have uh, Motoko invasions every year in Botswana and in the Northwest. So, yeah. How's that though? How's the vibe though of having your double HPs, your Caspers in <laughs> that space, being in that space of so much creativity? Yeah, it's overwhelming and it makes me a better artist because I look up to them uh, uh, that's why I say I take them as my brothers. I don't see, I don't take it as a competition. I don't compete with them because I feel like I still have to learn a lot from them because they have more experience than I do, you know. So it's more about a relationship, mm. brother and sister kind of relationship. I respect them so much and I look up to them. They inspire me. I listen to them a lot. Let's talk about working with AB Crazy. How was that? Um, working with AB Crazy was very nice because he's so different. He can sing and his production as well is different from what I'm used to, mm. you know. So I just wanted to challenge myself and do something different. And I knew that he's going to give me that because he understands me now, you know. He knows, like, what, the ty what type of music I, I would want to do now for me to be able to accommodate everyone in the country and not just the people in the Northwest. So also with him, I learned a lot because um, he gave me good advices. That's why Kisses became so big now mm. that people are talking about it now. Um, it was basically about making it, you know, a soft song, uh, easy for people to catch and sing along to. All right. Uh, when is the album coming out? Um, I was working on my EP, so now we changed because now people want the album. Yeah. So hopefully September, the latest. Uh, material, is the material ready all? You just need to just put yeah, it yeah, together? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm just left with two, three tricks, you know. Uh, I, I just want to make a good album. I just don't want to rush it yeah. because people want the album, you know. So I'm still taking my time. I'm still fixing my songs every time. I just had like, I just, uh, I'm in a studio where I live so that I can be able to record anytime, you know, so that it could be perfect. I just want it to be a perfect album. Uh, all right. Fifi, thank you so much for talking to us. Thank Fifi you so Cooper, much. female hip hop artist. I can't imagine beats are by so much <laughs> talent. I'm so envious. Well, uh, she, uh, her latest single is titled, uh, kisses and she'll perform it for us a little later on the program. Uh, let's take a now break. Stay with us.